Back to Michael Jordan, jumper from out on the left. Good! The Star Heels win the national championship! The Chicago Bulls pick Michael Jordan. My own expectations are just to go in and con try to contribute, you know, and uh, don't try to do anything out of the ordinary. You know, I was all by myself, so it was time for creation. 63 for Jordan, a new NBA record. Whenever I go against good or great competition, you know, I enjoy that. It makes me become a better basketball player. Michael Jordan scores. They gave him a 50. They gave Jordan a 50. One bounce dribble now to Jordan. Michael in for the left side, jammed it right over Rollins. Here's Michael at the foul line, a shot on Elo. I've really set a standard for myself, which is normal. But then you have to step it up another level to be above normal. Steel, he kept it in bounds. Here it is again. Oh! Yes! Everyone's saying that a scoring leader can't be an NBA champion. I never believed that. I got seven years of it to sink in. You know, it can't sink in in, in in just a few hours. It's gonna take a while for it to sink in. How hard is it to be Michael Jordan sometimes? Very difficult sometimes. It's a different feeling. It's a different type of pressure to be in front of cameras and to, to act and to do a commercial. At some point in time, I'm gonna have to walk away from all this and, and try to get into a normal style of life. Here's Jordan. I surprised him as much as I surprised you and myself with the way I was shooting the ball. And here's Trump with the open floor. Mike Angela. Whose game is it? It's Michael Jordan's game. I saw so much of that round ball that, you know, I kind of lost the taste for it at that particular time, and I needed a mental break. How long did it take you to miss it? A couple weeks. Oh, and Reggie Miller came over and smacked All right, Michael. okay, we got a brouhaha here. Certainly, destiny shall be back here for the fourth time. Thank you. On August the 5th, 1993, a red Lexus was found in a wooded area. This vehicle belonged to the Mr. James Jordan, father of Michael Jordan. He was shot to death while in his car. We're pretty strong and we're moving forward and with our lives. And uh, we got a lot of memories to think about. And uh, you know, we just had to keep forward. A shocking revelation tonight for all Chicagoans. Bull star Michael Jordan will announce his retirement tomorrow. I achieved practically everything I could from an individual standpoint and from a team standpoint. And it really made it easy to walk away while you was on top. Will I ever unretire? I don't know. Hey, Mike, get out of here, baby. A lot of people may think it's off the wall. Maybe it is. The White Sox will let me know if they feel that I'm not, I'm not doing well. Michael Jordan is returning. He released a press release today that said, quote, I'm back. At the time that I retired, I didn't have anything to prove. Now I got something to prove. Are you as good now as you were when you left? I'm better. The 5.5 Michael Jordan. The Bulls have won 70. Bulls are the champions of the world. Oh, an emotional moment for Michael Jordan. I know he's rocking. This is my daddy. I'm very happy for him. I too have a newfound love for the game of basketball. The big story here tonight, Michael Jordan's physical conditions. He is suffering from flu-like symptoms. I really felt like I was on deathbed. Bulls are going to win the NBA championship again. The drive for five. That's the biggest bottle of champagne you've had so far in all the other finals. I mean, uh, when we get six, it's going to be bigger. A lot of people question some of the things that I can do now or people don't know if I could do. That's the beauty of the creator is that you don't know until it's done. All right, it's win or lose. Game six for the Bulls. 
10 seconds. Jordan, 20 footer, head of the key. Good! The Chicago Bulls have won their sixth NBA championship. We do this again for the second time. I am here to announce my retirement from the game of basketball. And a lot of people say, well, Michael Jordan didn't have any challenges away from the game of basketball. Well, I dispute that. This is a different challenge for me. Basketball has been my life, so this is an easy transition for me. Last time we saw you on the court in 98, that night, that shot, did you have any idea then that that would be the last time you played? Uh, I was pretty sure of it. It's a little bit different. I'm 38 years old, but I feel like I can play the game of basketball at the highest level. When I then got 20 right off the bat, and then sort of petered out. That's a good way of putting it, petered out. <laughs> well, you got tired. Just, just say I got tired. You know, but the thing about it is my love for the game is strong as ever. Seconds remaining. Michael has the ball. The fadeaway. Yes! There's 28 games left in your career. How do you look at that? Not much time. Mm -hmm. There's the end of a legendary career. Michael, it's been an honor to call your games and a privilege to watch you play. Now I guess it hits me that you know, I'm not going to be in a uniform anymore. And that's not a terrible feeling. It's something that I've come to grips with and it's time. Time. Six rings, ten scoring titles, five MVPs, all defense nine times. Did I leave anything out? Two Olympic gold medals. <laughs> One word to sum up your career. Fun. <laughs>